Hi! Welcome to Seeing Through the Hand Studio. I'm Emily and I'm here to welcome you to the third series of Office Stretches. We're doing the forearm strength there. Pause the video if you need and go find a rubber band. Here we have a rubber band. You're going to put it at the very bottom of your fingers. It's important to keep it at the bottom because the ligaments up top are too weak. So keep it at the bottom and you're going to open and close. Open and close. It's important because we so often use these muscles and it's important to strengthen them so we can use them more fully. So again, on the other side, take the rubber band, put it at the base of your knuckles, open and close strengthening the extrinsic muscles of the forearm. This is a great one to pair up with the very first forearm stretch we did at the very first series. So go back and look at the series, pair up, do the stretch, and then the strengthener. Now we're gonna do a neck opener. What this does is this opens the platysma muscle, which is the very superficial muscle of the neck. It's important to work superficially and then go deep. You're going to grab the collarbones, really grab them nice and firmly. I'm really having a nice hold. Bring your teeth together and bring your chin up. Make sure to use your breath. So again, clasp the collarbones, teeth together, and chin up, breathing deeply. And release. We're going to do a chest opener. Clasp your hands behind your back and switch the thumb positions. Re-switch the claps. So if this is what you did, go like this. It's good to change the neural pathways. Now, bend the forearms and try to bring the elbows towards each other. So it's very common for people to do this one, and that's a great one too. But that focuses more on the joints. So what I want you to do is just grab your elbows towards each other, keeping them nice and bent. Now, if all you can do is this, that's fine. If this, that's fine. Wherever you are, it's perfect. It's all about the process and staying with yourself. And no competition, not with yourself and not with anyone else. And now let's try it from the back. Clasping the opposite class that you're used to. Bending the elbows, bringing the elbows towards each other. Imagining the collarbones being spread like wings on your back. Spreading, spreading, spreading as your elbows go closer, closer, closer as your palms try to touch, touch, touch. And breathing. Now we're going to do alternate nostril breathing called Nadi Sudi. This balances the right and left hemisphere of the brain. Now the only other thing that does that is driving in a car, and that does it in an entirely different way. So this is very beneficial to do. This calms the mind and is good for relaxation. Great for a stressful situation. Take your right arm up, keep your elbow in, thumb, pinky, ring finger out. Close the right nostril gently. Breathe out the left, breathe in the left, release the thumb. Close the left nostril gently, breathe out the right, breathe in the right, release the pinky and ring finger. Close the right nostril, out, in, release thumb, left nostril, closing it with the pinky and ring finger, out, in, release the thumb. Now that I've described the exercise, please do it with me. Shutting the eyes, closing the right nostril, breathing out the left. Breathing in the left, releasing the thumb, closing the left nostril with the pinky and ring finger, breathing out the right, breathing in the right, and release.
Nadi Sudi alternate nostril breathing is usually done with the right hand, but let's try it for the left, just for the fun. Taking the left elbow in, thumb and pinky ring finger out, closing the left nostril with the thumb, breathing out the right, breathing in the right, closing the right with the pinky and ring finger, breathing out the left, breathing in the left. So do it with me, please. Since breathing is unconscious, it's often hard for us to remember to take big, full breaths. That's why Nadi Sudi is so important. Please, in any stressful situation, do alternate nostril breathing. Thank you for being a part of the third series of office stretches. Please go to NewYorkCityMassageAndYoga.com for more information. Thank you. Look forward to seeing you soon and have a sparkly day. Namaste.